handy dandy Harbor Freight liquid transfer pump. All right, welcome to Lone Wolf Garage. Uh, yeah, here with the bikes, doing some uh, some gassing up. Uh, yeah, had some crazy weather here in Connecticut yesterday. Uh, pretty sure we had a tornado. Pretty sure uh, took out half my backyard. I'll show a, a shot of that here. Yeah, if you're like me, uh, you like to keep gasoline in your garage and uh, fill the bikes up before you even leave. Problem is, is picking up gas cans sucks sometimes, especially when you have five or six gallon ones. But yeah, I got this uh, little uh, easy to use liquid transfer pump from Harbor Freight. Uh, yeah, I know people have uh, you know their misgivings about Harbor Freight, but honestly, I've got a bunch of tools from there. And they're still working, you know. When they do break, I tend to go buy something a little nicer. But especially if it's something I just need once or twice, I just buy it from them. Or if it's something like this when it was on sale for like $9 or $10, give it a shot. And it's working pretty good. So yeah, one of my bikes is obviously a Sportster. And they don't have a fuel gauge on them. So sometimes it is really beneficial to have gas in the garage because, you know, I may come home and... Not even pay attention to the little gas light that comes on on the speedometer. And I end up with no gas in the bike. So this guy, the pump side goes inside. Looks like, looks like this. Goes inside of the gas can. The hose goes inside of the tank. It's battery operated. Little button on top. And the gas starts flowing. Obviously, you just got to pay attention to make sure you don't overflow. But it's as simple as that. So, yeah, that's my handy dandy Harbor Freight liquid transfer pump. Uh, it takes two D batteries, pumps six quarts a, a minute, supposedly. More about one gallon a minute. Uh, it takes about three minutes to fill up the Sporty when it's empty. Uh, about five minutes to fill up the Dyna when she's empty. Uh, not as quick as a pump. Um, at the gas station, it is certainly better than holding up a gas can for four or five minutes because those take just as long. And yeah, this will definitely help you if you're just looking to top off before you leave the garage so you don't have to uh, participate in moto pumping right off the bat on your uh, adventures. Uh, you're gonna have to stop at some point, obviously, because yeah, we all know we're out there all day long. Hopefully that gives you guys an idea of, uh, you know, how this uh, little, liquid transfer pump works and if it's worth for you to go get one at Harbor Freight. Again, you know, hit or miss with uh, their tools, but this one I've had it for about four months now and it's been running strong, uh, 10 bucks. All right, if you uh, like that one, give it a big old thumbs up. If you don't, well, whatever, you do you. And if you haven't subscribed, hit that subscribe button. All right, folks, rock on.